What's up guys? Classy Metal here. Uh, two days, two videos. I'm back already. I just got off work. I came home and I had a decent little stack of stuff that came in the mail today. So I figured what the heck, I'll just go ahead before I fall farther behind on making these uh, collection updates. I'll just do an unboxing. I know what uh, a couple of these are. One of them, I'm not quite sure what it is. But anyway, uh, first up, I have a package here. I love. I have to come in ominous domain i love the way that they ship their cds they come in these stuff there's one cd in this uh in this box that i ordered and i never have to worry about the uh the album arriving with busted uh a busted jewel case or digipack or damage to the album whatsoever i commend i love the way that ominous domain ships and uh definitely worthwhile ordering from them you don't have to worry about anything being damaged and all that good stuff so one of my favorite places to order from I've kind of been slacking lately from getting stuff from them but and then on the inside you can see they they wrap it in bubble wrap put these little peanuts in there so fantastic shipping job thank you ominous domain for that I give you many many props for that what we have here is an atmospheric black metal band out of Germany I wanted to order this from the directly from the band from their band camp, but getting uh, this album shipped to me straight from overseas would have been ridiculous. The the shipping that they were asking was all, just awful. It was atrocious, and I waited, uh, hoping that a distro or someone here in the U.S. would get some copies of this. And finally, Ominous D D Domain got some. I think they had two copies, so I had to grab one while it was still. In stock, what we have is uh, Annie Gone's Fate with their album entitled Insomnia. The name of the album slipped my mind. Fantastic. One of my favorite releases from 2018 so far, if not my favorite. I've given this so many spins on YouTube. I had to, I had to get a physical copy because I felt guilty from uh, playing the replay button over and over and over on YouTube. So let me open it up and get a better look at it fight that glare off the artwork on it very atmospheric black metal-esque type artwork fantastic stuff it's kind of depressive atmospheric black metal i'm going to link up the band's band camp in the description that way you can you can listen to this for yourself and order yourself a copy if you feel so inclined i will link up the description to the omnis domain uh they put a card in there as well on this domain business card if they still have that other copy available i will link that up in the description as well so one of you can jump on that if you're so inclined i didn't plan this out very well bear with me for just a second while i find somewhere to sit that so already fantastic stuff starting out the next one i'm not quite sure what this is it's uh a cd obviously it's from canada so I'm not sure. I'm sure it's a, a band camp. I did a lot of quite a few order pre-orders a few I guess I guess a month or two ago on band camp. And I like doing pre-orders because you have stuff to show up and you're never never quite sure what what's going to come in what day. It's always uh, exciting to get stuff in the mail like that. And now I know what this is. So this is a op van. This is a mid-eastern themed i guess atmospheric black metal black metal as i said it has that that mid-eastern kind of vibe going on with the instrumentation and stuff going on with that the name of this album is forgotten path uh forgotten glory sorry very interesting very unique original ideas going on in this i think that's what drew me to it it kind of stood out from some of the other black metal releases that i've been listening to this year this is another fantastic 2018 release if you haven't checked this out definitely do yourself a favor especially if you're into black metal atmospheric black metal that type stuff to say it's got that mid-eastern instrumentation going on fantastic stuff on that one as well and i have a record believe it or not i don't order just a ton of vinyl but when the price is right and i get a good deal and it's a band or an album that i really love I will jump on it. Obviously, the CD is my preferred format, but there are some albums that I would uh, that I would get and listen to on vinyl. 
Let me get this open. This is from Transcending Records. If you follow this channel at all, you know how much I love Transcending. And they tend to reciprocate that love back to me quite often. I'm sure that just spoiled the uh, what it is. They put some padded mailers in here, which is pretty awesome of them to protect that vinyl for me. So, props to Mike and, the, and Transcending Records for that. Hopefully I didn't spoil it too much when I pulled it out of the, the record mailer. We have Monolith Cult with their 2017 release, Gospel of Despair. If you watch my favorite albums of 2017, you will remember seeing this on that end of the year list. Fantastic uh, doom metal out of the UK. Let me get this out. This is on blue vinyl. I don't know how well the light's going to pick that up. Kind of a very royal blue, I guess, is the pretty pretty neat looking vinyl there. I'm not going to take it all the way out because I don't have to fight just the uh, track listing there on the sticker. So awesome stuff there. Let me find somewhere to sit that so I don't damage. Looks like we have a poster with it as well. I didn't know that they were going to throw a poster in. So, Monolith Cult poster. I will have to find somewhere in this room. I am out of room in this room to hang that, but I definitely, I love the artwork on this enough that I will make room, even if I have to take something else down. They threw a sticker in there as well. Then I'll show the sleeve. I already showed it once, but I'll take it out of the plastic to show it. So, all in all, pretty awesome mail day today. Definitely a great way to come home from work. Uh, that's all I've got for today. I thank you guys for watching. I will link up everything that I got in this video in the description so you can check it out on your own. Link up the link to uh, Transcending Records where the vinyl for Monolith Cult is available. I will also link up a stream. So you can check out the music from Monolith Cult as well, if you're so inclined. Like I said, they have the, the blue vinyl, and I believe they have black, standard black vinyl for that as well. So definitely check that out, especially if you're, uh, I know some of you enjoy collecting records much more than I do. So definitely go get yourself a copy of that. As I said, that's all I got for today. So I will see you soon. I have some other stuff that I, I need to show. I don't know when I'll get that up, but hopefully soon. So stay classy, stay metal, and I will see you soon.